Hello, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ijama. I'm a family medicine attending and I'm running a few errands today. I'm getting out of the house. It's the day before my birthday and um, I'm going to be looking for a birthday dress. I have an Amazon return. I'm going to do a little bit of grocery shopping and I think that's about it. If you can tell, to change things up, I colored my hair and got highlights. You can't really see everything. It was really rainy today, and so I just don't want, I don't want, I have a, so I got a silk press on my hair, and I don't want to hear any stories about anything going wrong, so I'm just wearing a hat, but you can tell a little bit of the colors, like a honey brown or whatever, and then I have blonde highlights, but you can't really see them, because um, most of the highlights are in the front, but um, I love it, and my hair is super long. Um, I'm still riding the wave of post-pregnancy hair gain um, and I don't really know exactly at what point postpartum hair loss or hair shedding may kick in for me but I was just like I want to make a change um, turning 30 and I just want to do something different so that's that's that um, I'm going to I'm at you I'm at um, I'm about to do my Amazon return and then um, go to the grocery store probably get food like eat myself as well because I haven't eaten lunch and then um go find my dress what I was returning actually was um a baby swing we bought or um, the Graco simple sway swing um, from what I saw, it was like a pretty reliable, durable, long-lasting, functional swing that would work pretty well and last a long time. But we got it, we assembled it last night, and it as it was swinging, it was doing this like, and it was like loud, like it was, you could hear it like over the, even like the little melodies that it was singing for the baby. And... Um, it was just like had this like rickety feeling i guess so we disassembled it and i just returned it and we ended up just getting the um getting the mamaru that was my other option but um from what i was seeing it seemed like the mamaru was more expensive less functional and like babies not all babies really like do well with it versus like the graco one was like more of a solid bet but i don't know i was disappointed by that Zhur, zhur, zhur sound i'm like okay um so yeah we'll see when the mamaru comes in and uh, if we like that one better all right so i went to get my eyebrows done i went and got my birthday nothing bunt cake the white chocolate raspberry um which is accompanying me here <laughs> and um then I just went to Kroger to get some groceries. I am getting food now and I'm going to eat it as I go on my way to the dress shop. All right, update. So I got my dress. I got it from Windsor. Um, it's a sexy black velvet gown. And then I got these silver strappy heels. Um, and then the last thing I just need is a clutch because I don't have a silver clutch. So I need to do that. I just finished left leaving DSW where I got my shoes and I'm just gonna get the clutch. I'm actually tired now, I need to get home. I need to relieve my mother-in-law. She was with the baby last night and now she's I, like left her with him. And of course she doesn't mind, but like I just be feeling bad if I'm out of the house for too long. So one last stop, get this clutch um, and then going home. one is cute it's not exactly i'm gonna hold on to it the shoe... i'll hold on to it it's not exactly what i'm looking for then. so oh boy this one is broken okay never mind well this type of material is a little bit more what i'm going for at least that's like the shoes are like more rhinestone-y than glittery but i think i'm not mad at this one it's cute Okay, now I just came across this one. Now this one just looks strange. I don't like this. I don't like this. But it is what more of what I'm going for. What is this hanging down? Ugh.
is still hungry. On Friday, Judy ate through five oranges. What's up, you guys? So today is um, the day after my birthday. So I turned 30 yesterday and I had in mind to vlog the entire day and then next thing you know the day was over and I was like, I forgot to vlog. Uh, but it was a very chill and fulfilling day. Like most of the day I spent with my son. Uh, we were just relaxing in the bed and um, doing, you know, he's on like a eat, play, sleep type of schedule, if you will. So I'll feed him. He'll be awake for a little bit. We'll do whatever, I talk to him, <laughs> read to him, tummy time, blah, blah, blah. He'll start getting cranky and sleepy, then he falls asleep. So we did that, a couple rounds of that, yes, um, in the beginning of the day. And then um, I, when Chris got back, because he did that only a half day, he does half days on Wednesdays, um, he did, he came back, we still chilled at home for a little bit, and then we went to the gym. Part of my birthday gift from him was new workout clothes. He always gives me new workout clothes. Number one, because he we like to work out a lot together. It's just one of the things that we share in common. He likes to look good in the gym and he wants me to look good in the gym. He likes, like he's, he's very attracted to that, um, like athletic, sporty look, like looking clean, nice clothes that fit well, like nice leggings, that type of stuff. He's very attracted to that. And so he got me some new clothes. So. I wore that to the gym, we worked out, and um, we came back and quickly got ready. It was a rush to get ready, which is why I couldn't really vlog, because we had a reservation with went to Steak 48, we had reservations 7.45, we had to like come back. He um, took um, he took Namdi's bath, and um, I did, while well, I got ready, so he did the bath gave him to his mom to like feed him and you know initiate evening routine or initiate evening sleep and then he got ready himself um and once we were ready we took some pictures uh yeah i we got we took some pictures then we went on our way uh, we had a wonderful dinner it was so nice we've been there this is our second time going there the last time we went there was our anniversary i think and the food is just always good the service is great we just enjoy it Obviously it's pricey, but like it's, for when you're celebrating something, it's really nice. So we had good food um, and we came back home and relaxed because uh, my mother-in-law has been sleeping with the baby this week. And so I'm not complaining. I always wake up with very, a lot of engorgement though, but um, at least it's nice like getting to sleep all the, through the night. So. Yeah, that's how my birthday went. It was really good. I posted on Instagram. Um, got lots of love. I, I, I think I hear him crying. I think I hear him waking up. Yep. Coming. <laughs> yes, that's him waking up. Um, I feel like if I don't finish this video though, I'm gonna never finish it. But basically, yes, that is how the night went. It was it was really good. I posted on Instagram, got lots of love because I posted him for the first time, um, some of his cute newborn pictures, and um, yeah. And then I posted my outfit and some pictures of that me and Chris took before we went to dinner. So you guys can check out those on Instagram or I'll probably just put them in the video too. Um, yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna tend to him and today's gonna be a pretty relaxing day. I will um, maybe, mm, probably get into maybe some things on the weekend that I can vlog that may be interesting. Honestly, right now, I don't know. Uh, but once I feel like I have enough content, I'll make another video. <laughs> um, so I'll catch you guys a little bit later in the week. Um, I just got this delivery in the mail today. Well, I just had to well, sign for a package that looks like a gift I didn't buy. And I so far don't see any note inside, but I see something here about time for a toast get ready to open a bottle and pour a glass. 
And then on the box, it says spa set. So. Okay, I found the note. Just as I was looking, I was supposed to put these things away. I found the note on the box. I will show you, but my address is there. And it is from Stacy. Happy 30th birthday. You deserve some pampering after killing it through your 20s. Thank you so much. Ah. Okay, I'm going to call her now. <laughs> One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and popped. Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. Can you see? You see the caterpillar or are you looking at me? Which one? <laughs> you see this one? What's up guys? I'm checking in. It is Saturday. Nope, it's Sunday of Labor Day weekend. Um, we've just been chilling. I just came back from running a few errands and then going to the gym. I've been getting more and more active at the gym, lifting heavier and um, just like going harder, I guess, you know, doing some more workouts on my own as opposed to just following the um, workout plans like I was doing before. I am seven weeks out from delivery and he is seven weeks old, just growing, growing, growing. I'm doing a little tummy time right now and um, yeah, it's been a pretty chill weekend. It's just me and Chris at home. My mother-in-law, she left for the weekend um, to her house. They live like 20 minutes away. So the, we kind of do the weekends and she's here helping us during the week. And um, yeah. Um, uh, I had to go, one of the things that I did today was go to Target to get him more clothes. So he was wearing newborn clothes and he um, has fastly grown out of those. He's now in like zero to three month. And so I need to get more zero to three month stuff, especially onesies for nighttime. Um, got some more of those and then some more pants like these, like he's wearing right now. Um, just to add to his stash, he has plenty of like onesies that are like the upper part, um, overflow of those, but we needed more like onesies for sleep which we use the one piece, like the footsie onesies, you know, um, the up and, I don't know, yeah, the, the full zip up onesies, we use those for sleeping. Um, and so we needed more of those and yeah, so I went to the store um, and I hope you guys are doing good and enjoying your holiday weekend. We got a few, a soon to be sleeper over here. So I'm gonna, um, him down and then just kind of chill with Chris. He's upstairs playing video games. And... Yeah, that's how the day's going over here. <laughs> hey, you guys. Um, today is Tuesday. It's the Tuesday of the other day, and I'm here at the OB office for my postpartum visit. Um, technically, almost eight weeks postpartum instead of six weeks, but this was like the closest available they had when I scheduled. Um, so yeah, I brought the. I brought the baby with me, as you can hear, um, and that's because um, Chris is at work and then my mother-in-law isn't at home with us. She's coming this evening. So we are here chilling. I'm waiting for the doctor to come on in. Just trying to keep him comfy. Good morning or good afternoon, you guys. Today is Wednesday. I am on my way to meet up with my friend Efi. We went to med school. She was my med school roommate. Um, she was a bridesmaid at my wedding and she now lives in Houston, Texas. She's OBGYN and is gonna be starting practice soon. So I have a new friend in town and I'm really happy about that. And uh, we're meeting up, we're gonna go to this uh, bowling place that also has food and get lunch and just like hang out cause she starts her new job next week. Um, and again, I'm able to do these things because my mother-in-law is with us and um, she has the baby now, although he's sleeping and um, Chris is at work. So yeah, I'm gonna have a good afternoon, have some fun and then um, have a pile of laundry waiting for me when I get back. Um, 
and I'll catch you guys uh, later. What's up guys? I thought I would close out the video, switch things up um, in my backyard. And um, yeah, you know, this video has just kind of been various days and various things that I've been doing while I've been on maternity leave. I hope you enjoy watching it. Um, basically, I, you know, I do the night shifts with my son. I get him ready in the morning. We do a little bit of playtime before I give him to my mother-in-law and then I go back to sleep for the day like today I didn't wake up again until 12 or like 12 30 almost one o'clock um, after recovering from the night shifts and then in the afternoons I kind of do my own thing um, some other updates lately um, we are in our child care hunt so then I interviewed a nanny yesterday who's a great candidate uh, we just want to make sure we agree on a couple of things um, between her and then like my, me and Chris before we move forward with her. But we're just plan getting ready for me going back to work. And um, yeah, so doing that. Otherwise, I do some workouts at home. Uh, that's part of my postpartum workout plan. I can do workouts at home or in the gym. Uh, so I do some at home. Um, just to break things up because some like sometimes it'll be like several days I would not leave the house at all another reason why I came outside I just blink my eyes and the days just like go by so fast and my son is two months now he turned two months yesterday so man it's just been um, a whirlwind but I hope that you have enjoyed watching this video I'm actively pumping I'm, I'm using the uh, willow pumps I just started using those I have them for going back to work because what I plan to do is um, pump uh, my commute because I don't think I'm going to be able to wake up early enough to do a full pump session at home then get ready for work because I was barely waking up early enough for work as it was uh, so I have the willow pumps to be like planning on pumping on my drive to work I like them um, they're not as they're not super comfortable if you will but um, it's nice to be able to like do other stuff they also don't extract as much milk like my spectra pump my i can get like six ounces out um in one breast six or weeks sometimes more um but the willows like they basically they stop when they get to four ounces so they don't even like let you get that much obviously because it's portable i can't hold that much so that's the only thing but it's nice though i, I like the portability of it i'm trying to get my body used to them um so i've been using those more so that's that's what we're doing as we vlog. Um, I've become a better multitasker these days. Uh, but yeah, I appreciate you guys watching this video. I hope that um, you've enjoyed just like spending some time with me. I think it spanned over like a couple of weeks. Um, I'll just keep on vlogging. I've got a few more weeks left before I go back to work. Oh my goodness. Um, I've already like we're trying to work out like certain accommodations trying to see if they can modify my schedule I think it just started raining trying to see if they can modify my schedule um, and um, have a better work-life balance for when I go back to work okay it's raining now I'm gonna go back inside um, I'll catch you guys in my next video Bye.